Hey everyone, Shadow Rockets here, and today I got some new map footage <laughs> of Halo 3. We're gonna say new map footage because uh, this is Ghost Town, and we <laughs> always used to refer to these as the new maps until I guess Orbital and the other ones came out. So I'm, I'm gonna go ahead and call it new maps. That's fair enough. It's it's safe assumption. I got some really aggressive gameplay today. I was I always try to show off for when I'm recording for YouTube. So. I, I managed to play relatively aggressively. Uh, I pick it up very, very much so towards the end, so I, I struggle a little bit at the beginning trying to just rush the other team as fast as I can. They they get some nice kills on me. I'm going to give them that much, but I do manage to scrape out some kills and stay positive. I believe I finished out this game with a 2.0 kill-death ratio or more. I got a nice, nice reaction assassination there. I just saw the person fall right in front of me and instant reaction to just melee and so that worked out in my favor sadly I lost a few teammates in that little skirmish but I managed to scrape out a victory in the end a little bit of an embarrassing jump right there a jump fail I kind of dodged the f full brunt of that grenade so I can get right back in the battle as fast as possible managed to scrape out another kill from that so all in all our team is staying ahead 10 to 7 not too too bad so I get another kill from this guest right here, Badger, well played, GG. And then I come around the corner and I think I have an easy kill lined up, but I get double teamed and they manage to kill one of their <laughs> two guys with a accidental brute shot, shot, grenade thing going off in their face. So that kind of, again, worked out to my favor. I guess that would be the lucky part of this match that... I, you know, I claim I always have a lucky part of every match, so that that could be it. I'm looking at the rockets there, like I want them really bad, and then quarter shy kind of runs right towards them, so I probably scared the heck out of that person just shooting at them. But that's okay, I come around the sneaky way around the corner, and so Monkey Man was not expecting me to come around and melee him in the face. I was not expecting three people to respawn right there. I thought I was going to have a nice, easy single kill around the corner, and then the rest of the team will spawn in over there. But I was wrong, and I got triple team. So uh, sometimes it just doesn't work out in your favor. I managed to follow Ma Monkey Madman. I'm going to gotta get all these names down, I'm trying to throw in everyone's names, give them their props as I, as I record. So Monkey Madman, I followed him with that battle rifle pretty nicely um, it's really crucial especially in this version of Halo 3 it seems I don't know why I didn't notice it so much in the 360 version but you definitely have to lead, lead the shots a little bit better in this one so I managed to do that on him and then grab two kills with the assault rifle I dodged the sniper earlier by just kinda of being sporadic jumping around I kinda of jumped off the wall and that's normally not something that people do. I, I try to jump as much as I can, actually. Uh, in the Halo 2, early Halo 3 days, jumping was just not the way to get away from a sniper. But if you're up close, that is one of the best ways to kind of avoid them, especially if you can keep pressure on them. That was a great snipe. Nerd! <laughs> I, I have one more of those that are pretty nice, a jump snipe coming up but then I end up getting triple team so uh, you, you take what you can get right I thought that his teammate was gonna come around the corner I was wrong the teammate decided to go in through the middle but I still managed to grab the kill thank you teammate for weakening him now this is a really sad example of me trying to no scope I, I do not no scope and that is the reason why I kind of get flashy with my moves jump off of walls and it just doesn't work out in my favor so I, I try to make up for it by running back in as fast as I can. Obviously, my teammate died and I died, so they managed to get two kills out of it, but I believe my teammate got one of them dead. So I can come around the corner and sneak attack this sniper. He doesn't see me coming because he's scoped in, so that kind of worked to my favor. I don't fear running through the energy drain here because I realize that my team is sort of in a all-around-me sort of position. So I don't really have to worry about anybody sneaking up on me anytime soon. Saw these two guys coming at me and decided to kind of hightail it out of there, maybe get a, a round shot. Nice jump shot. Oh my goodness, headshot right there. So I keep going around the corner and I probably should have taken out the sniper rifle at this point, but I thought that I could just grab them before the rest of their team came around and that did not work in my favor. Obviously their entire team was right there. 
So I'm sitting at 15 kills, which is nearly half of our team's kills, so that's pretty nice. I get a nice little melee here, and I try my grenade trick. Sadly, that doesn't work as well when you're almost dead and simple melee to kill me, so that was not well thought out. The grenade really didn't do too much to him. He didn't exactly get trapped. This guy tries to get away down below, and he just gets a warm welcoming into my domain, so that was probably not his best move. Crazy Zoe here. I think I get two kills on Crazy. Um, I kind of go on a little spree of, I think it was four kills or so, just right here in the middle of the map. I really probably should not have been getting kills here, but I managed to scrape out four, like I said, and then obviously the rest of the team spawns in, and I get wrecked. I'm rip. So I'm sitting at 21 kills now, <laughs> continuing the trend of borderline half of my team's kills. I, I really, I don't know, it just, it works out that way. I guess I'm in the right place at the right time just tends to work out for me. I thought I could get him with a grenade, but he's nice, comes back out for me. Actually, I think that's a different person. However, I may, I may lead a little too early. I got a little excited, not gonna lie. But I managed to grab one of the kills, at least right here, and I believe I finish up with a nice double kill for the victory. So I hope you like, favorite, comment, and subscribe, and enjoyed this gameplay thoroughly, because I know I did. Shadow Rockets out.